think a light runner is somebody who follows God at their hardest and tries to help people whenever they can. No matter what the cost, no matter what the price, they don't care about popularity statuses. Don't compromise for the things of the world and make sure that you're solid in your foundation. To take a step and move the right direction even if no one else is moving that way yet. We're followers of Christ just like sheep follow their shepherd. I learned about identity and you should be yourself. God made you how he wanted you to be there and he put you on the earth for a purpose. I learned this week at church camp that you should turn to God to face your problems. Give your three G's, give God glory. I learned to give God your all every day and glorify him in everything you do no matter what it is. My name is Hannah and I got saved Wednesday. I'm going to continuously and gradually grow in my faith, but now I know that I'm with God. I'm going to be with God one day, and that's, that's amazing. No matter what happens, God will always be there for you. To be a light runner is to do things for other people because you love them, because God created them. Oftentimes we don't own the fact that man, God has called us to something greater, to be one who, who runs with that light that He's given us, to take it not only to our communities, but to the ends of the earth. There's going to be a lot of people that are in darkness that need a light runner, somebody to take the gospel. Uh, Jesus said, I'm the light of the world. And he, he lifted, uh, if he's lifted up, he will draw all men to him. John 3 tells us that. So as these students become light runners, and as light runners become an everyday part of their life, they'll literally be people who take the gospel to a lost and dark world. No matter what you say, no matter what you do, God loves you. He has an awesome plan for your life. Remember we talked about Jeremiah 29 11, where God says, I know the plans I have for you, plans to prosper you, not to harm you, plans to give you a hope and a future. And then it goes on to say that the way you discover that plan, to have it come true, is you've got to follow him and seek him with all of your heart. God has amazing plans for you.